GPM our surf report. This is the complicated system I came up with to measure the difference in the angle of attack between Armstrong A plus and non A plus all the fuses. I'll show you quickly what I'm doing. So that's a marble uh, countertop, so I'm assuming that is really flat. And the fuses are both sitting on my phone which is laying flat and I'm assuming that one is pretty flat too. I don't want the screws at the tail to touch and to be involved in changing angle. I don't want any other part of the fuse. So that is how I am achieving the leveliness of things. Now the screwdriver is only there to keep the thing level and so it doesn't move on the roll axis and I just measured that with the A plus sorry the um, plus one titanium shim on the uh, non A plus I get a measure that is just mm, valueless other than you know relative meaning yeah of nine no seven eighths yeah at each tip um, so what I'm gonna do now is to mount the same exact tail on the other fuse, probably swap in position, and find out what, how many plastic shims or what kind of plastic shims I need to get the same exact measurement. Okay, now the tail is on the A plus with only one red shim, and surprise, it's exactly at seven eighths like the same tail with the plus one titanium on the non A plus. Huh. I'm gonna measure the zero, not that I care because I only use it one plus one, but I'm super curious at this point. Okay, yeah, gonna make it short. So back to non A plus zero shim. I leveled it and it was how you call that? Uh, sorry there. How do you call that? Um, one sixteenth less than seven eighths. What a screwed up system. Give me some millimeters back. What is that? Um, 15, 14, 13 sixteenth on each side. Now I'm going to put it without any shim on. Okay, the same tail is now on the A plus with no shim at all and I get exactly the same measurement as with the zero degree titanium. I'm surprised because uh, I am not a A plus fuse user but I read many places that they leveled it differently so that no shims was meaning like minus one or something but according to these measurements they should be exactly the same. Okay, one other little thing that this whole thing taught me or make me notice is that with the A plus uh, fuse the two screws are sitting a little better inside those holes. Alright so I put the screws in and for some reason because the hole they look exactly the same but for some reason the um, A plus which is the furthest away the head the screw head sinks and sits better than this other guy it's really hard to film but everything counts I'm gonna try to make that hole a little deeper somehow in my non A plus fuse so that the head of the screws doesn't show up alright I hope you're satisfied with the level of foil nerdiness because I think I went pretty high and please let me know what do you think about the system I just came up because again, it, to me, it looked like they were both perfectly leveled on my phone, but I might be missing something. Thank you very much.